What's going on, friends? My name's Skylint. Today we're playing some Tyra. This is gonna be uh, sort of, something like a first impression. I'm only like level two with her, so we're playing some casual. We're gonna go with this uh, rank one uh, little card lo loadout here. So let's see. Cannot be slowed more than fifty percent. Very consistent. Increased movement speed. Forty percent reload speed after using grenade launcher. So we always pew pewing. That's her strong suit. Hunter's mark and ammo count. Sounds good. Sounds all around pretty good. You'd think you would specialize in the Q because that's kind of like a defining feature of her. It's for the area denial. For the that's the fire grenade. But um, no. Nah. No, nah, we're just gonna go with the pew pew because that's what makes her really freaking strong. Anyways, so this is gonna be more of a casual look. I mean, we're literally playing casual, uh, but this is gonna be a casual um, play gameplay. We're not really talking about how good she is, really, you know, tier lists or anything like that. Um, kind of, maybe. We'll dive into that just a little bit, but really, this is more on the fun factor. Her overall design and how she fits in Paladin's lore and all that good stuff. So here we go. Let's also just, you know, actually try to play the game and maybe do a little bit, a little bit of some good. I'm gonna wait until I see a tank actually jump on here before I go any further. My thanks, you Don't want to just spam my abilities because uh, we do got some longer cooldowns. There we go. Just make sure that whenever you use something, it's at least gonna hit somebody. You can also tap fire and get headshots with this character. Gotta watch your ammo count though. See, they're being pushed off pretty easily though. A lot of teams uh, getting discombobulated. I could have effed him, but I thought I was gonna, gonna you know, insta give him. Okay, well, that was a waste of a cooldown. That was just me being shaky. Anyway, so Tyra is a hunter, actually, or a huntress, which is pretty interesting uh, because she has a Molotov. <laughs> so I think that's actually a cool thing. Like, normally, I don't think a hunter would have that. But the fact that a hunter does in the Paladin's world makes you think what kind of beasts are in the Paladin's universe where she would freaking need a Molotov. Uh, I think that's pretty good. And a fucking grenade launcher at that. Anyways, so she's, uh, she's kind of a, a behemoth killer, man. Let's go fight this guy. Do some big damages here. Back. Probably should have tap fire a little bit against that guy. Uh oh, she's got the shields, man. She got the shields, the Makoa. All right, we're gonna we're gonna fire bomb over there. It does damage based on uh, percent HP, right? So it's gonna be really good for tanks, and you want to normally use it on. Um... Oh shit! Probably shouldn't have used it on her. She's just gonna hide. No, she's gonna come right for us. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Big damages. Grenade out. Yeah, just a lot of area denial. Uh, even denial with just a uh, hit scan. I mean, if you're in line of sight, you better watch out, man. Better watch out. Now, I think a sniper would be pretty good against her because she can't quite counter snipe, but I mean, a little bit. It depends. Oh, hello. I guess you tried to be aggressive or something. Oh. Yeah, the Makoa got me, though. I like the way she looks. Uh, kind of Nordic in design. Um, and her, her kit kind of reminds me a lot of, I guess, kind of like... If you ever played Black Ops, you know, you can get some, you can get some pretty weird weapons in that game. Yeah, kind of like that. Kind of like that. Oh yeah, so if I didn't explain, her F allows you to do more damage. So you uh, you tag somebody and it allows only you to do more damage. So it's like a Zenyatta's Discord Orb, but just for you. Now you can get some cards to play around with that, and I actually do have some cards in my loadout so that I believe I move a little bit faster uh, when I mark somebody. Cooldowns are pretty long though, for all these different abilities. Um, oh yeah, now we have our ultimate. We're gonna show that off too, guys. So the ultimate is um, pretty standard stuff. Like all in all, her kit is really standard. But in the world of Paladins, it's actually kind of exciting. Even though we do have Victor, and honestly, Victor is very similar. Uh, it just, I think she, I think she does work. And I think it's actually pretty cool that Paladins is gonna ha start having uh, more similar characters, not copies, you know, like not like Ken versus Ryu and Street Fighter, but you know, similar archetypes. And I think that's good because of the type of game that it is. It's a hero shooter, but unlike Overwatch, you can't have copies of heroes. So it's kind of cool to have similar heroes um, that maybe are slightly different or play just a little bit differently mechanically. So yeah. I shouldn't have marked him. He was gonna. He was definitely dead already. This ain't good. Uh, damn. I. He was really glitchy right there. But that was my bad, I guess. Yeah, when he goes into the dragon's fury, man, he he aims so weird. Like he just kind of. I don't know. He doesn't move quite smoothly. You know what I'm talking about? Cassie, get out of here, man. Get out of here. All right. So I might uh, just kind of throw this over there because I'm tired of that chick. I'm tired of that chick. As soon as I see their tank, though, I'm gonna f him and then I'm gonna e. Um, actually, it could be good to uh, to e right before you reload. Because then, uh, you kind of bypass the reload animation, actually. So, very similar to a mechanic to, um, oh shit, I knew she was gonna get me. I should just walk backwards. It's similar to a mechanic to Soldier. So, in Soldier, his ultimate's the same way. Um, let's go ahead and get Life Rip, man, because why not? Now, maybe you might want to get Nimble. It depends on how aggressive you're being, but, uh, overall, she is Area Denial. I don't know if it's super necessary, unless you're, you know, specifically being aggressive, and then you can just have the card, uh, with your F to give you movement speed. So, hold on, Cassie, get, get out of here, my Cassie. Alright, let's show off that ultimate. Let's go ham here. Alright. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, I don't know what she's doing. But here's the ulti! 
And it doesn't last that long, but we can do a lot of damage there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Plush. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, no. Yeah, his range is actually surprisingly long. Um, so that is a downside, you know. You, you're not Victor, you can't run all over the place. Uh, my mark was off cooldown too, so that was my bad, guys. This is my bad. Yeah, um, so I guess I should really use the mark for running back, uh, dueling, or for just, uh, hunting down a kill. I don't know, you gotta really watch out, man, you gotta watch out. But if you're just gonna stand your ground, holy shit, dude, she can do some damage. Let's throw that there. Get out of here with this, get out of here with this. Uh-oh, the wind-up, guys. The wind-up, I'm gonna mark him, because... Oh, wait, did I mark him? Uh, did I miss him? Did I miss a mark? Ah, we got the vic- There it is, there it is. Now, honestly, guys, it was a short- It was a short game, but, like, honestly, Tyra is actually pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> like, honestly, I- I don't even know what else to say, man. I don't even know what else to say. Uh, <laughs> now, I do I do stream a lot of hero shooters, so if you guys want to see more in-depth gameplay, I'm gonna get her to ranked, and, uh, we might play a little bit of ranked with her, but, yeah, she's pretty similar to, uh, other archetypal uh, characters, really. Um, so not too much to say. I think she's kind of a counterpart to Victor, and that's kind of an interesting premise in Paladins. I want to reiterate that again, guys. Is Paladins is a game of picks and bans. So it makes sense, you know, unlike Overwatch, to have characters that are a little bit more similar to other characters um, than other games do. That makes sense, guys. Thanks for watching. Anyways, just a super short clip of Tyra and how I think that, yeah, I mean, she's kind of, you know, obvious and, you know, clean cut, but at the same time, it's kind of fun in the world of Paladins itself, mechanically. So, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have fun. My name is Skylight, and I'll see you in the next one.